Hey everyone, great to see you. Alejandro here at Piano Perfect, and today I'm going to teach you how to play Down by Marion Hill. This riff is the perfect riff to get started playing piano. It's fun, it's easy, and once you've learned it, you can do one of my favorite things, and that's teach it to someone else. I've linked a practice track in the description below that you can play along to once you're ready. And before we get started, I just want to share with you that Piano Perfect got another patron on our Patreon page. This is so exciting and represents a huge step towards making this channel a great success. So feel free to check out my Patreon page. It's where I keep all the audio files and sheet music files from these videos. Thanks so much everybody for your support. To learn this song, you can simply follow my hands from the demonstration or continue watching and I'll break it down for you. Okay, so here's the tutorial portion. I'm just going to play through it one time slowly. Two, three, four. So there's basically five different hand positions that you're going to want to go through. The first one is this one. And notice that middle C is right over here, okay? This is the middle C of your keyboard. So it's going to start on the C that's below middle C. You have C, G. And just gripping that with your three fingers, pinky, middle, and thumb. Ba, ba, da. Those are the first three songs, or the first three notes of this song. So it goes ba, ba, da, da. Right? So going from this position to this position. And just practice that. Just start off there. You can do it again. Slowly. And my thumb stays glued on that G, okay? So you can practice this way just to get your hand accustomed to the shapes. And when you're ready, you can play it as written. Right? And so that's kind of your first grip, all right? So here your second grip looks like this. And you're going from this position, A flat C E, to this position. And so you're going to arpeggiate. Play those three notes. And I slide my thumb to the D, and then the other fingers fall in line. So you put it all together. Okay, that's basically the whole song. There's just one more change. So when you go and do it again, this time around, you go all to white keys, okay? So G, B, and D. And that's basically the whole song. That's it. Just take your time, you know, practice your hand shapes, slide, practice your hand shapes. Remember the second time around, you're gonna to go to those white keys. Here we go. White keys, okay? One, two, three, four. Repeat. One, two, and three, four. That's, just, that's, that's it. That's the whole song right there. So once you feel pretty confident, then you can start to use the practice track. So let me put it on right now so we can see what it's like. Two. Three. You just want to feel the beat to start. Three, four. And when you're ready, you can hop in, maybe even do just the beginning. One, two, three, and. and then you can rest. One, two, again, go. Right? And just you don't have to do the second one until you're good and ready. So you do it again. And you can take your time. Let's try the second one. You're going to go to black notes. Do that second one again. Three, four. Maybe when we practice the second one, we can go to the white keys. Here we go. Right? Okay. So now let's practice that transition from the beginning. And jump. Leading with a pinky. Here's the A flat. White keys. Okay, let's try that again. Take it again, but this time we go to the white keys, okay? And sometimes I just like to mix it up. You can do like that, right? Make it choppy. Right? And come up with your own rhythms. 
music in return. Just like that. That's how you play this song. Okay, awesome job, everybody. Thanks so much for tuning in. It's been a blast. Check in, stay tuned for more great content. See you next time.